World Extreme Cage Fighting presents four huge fights to close out 2009. Donald Cowboy Cerrone looks for a title shot by throwing down with Ed 9mm Ratcliffe. And knockout artist Anthony Anjakowani squares off against Chris Horodesky. Plus Mitsugaki versus Jorgensen and Benavidez versus Yaya. World Extreme Cage Fighting presents Cerrone versus Ratcliffe. Live Saturday, December 19th from the Pearl Theater at the Palms Casino Resort in Las Vegas, Nevada. Only on Versus. I've been in martial arts a, a long time, and this is my chosen path. My reputation is at stake in this fight. If I lose this, or if I don't have a good showing in this, then it's hard to say where I stand as far as that title goes. I've been very close to the title two times now. I've been there, got knocked back, took the fight against Ben, got reset back. Tons of frustration, tons of training, training, training to get something so hard and not getting it. So Ed standing my way to get back again, and. Hell, third time's a charm. The yeah, Donald Cerrone and Ed Rackler fight. It's probably gonna be one of the most explosive stand-up fights we've seen in a while. Two guys that are not gonna take each other down, who are gonna stand there and explosively try to take each other's heads off with kicks, strikes. I see it ending in a vicious knockout. <laughs> Donald Cerrone is so composed under duress. No matter uh, what's going on in the fight, when a lot of other individuals would be panicking, uh, he doesn't. Uh, his greatest strength can be that he can, you know, weather the storm and just keep marching you down. There's no quitting this dog, no way. No way, no how, no quit. You'll never see me shy away, turn away, back down, back up. I'll come in one speed, straight forward. Oh, he connects one more time to Cowboy. And that's it. No, Ed Ratcliffe, his most dangerous weapon is his unorthodox abilities. Throwing spinning hook kicks to a lot of the different strikes he throws at different angles, off counter to timing. Everything I throw is, is with intent. Everything that comes off, every movement, every jab, every every feint, every hesitation is, is calculated. Whoever has the title, be it Henderson, Farner, or whoever that else is in line, it, I'm coming. <laughs> I'm right behind you. That nice strike is dangerous. I'm going to use his game against him. It's a chess game to me. I'm not going out and trying to finish him with a pawn. I'm using the whole arsenal. I'm bringing the whole artillery to Cerrone. I'm definitely going for a knockout, 100%. The opportunity when presents him, he leaves a lot of gaps and holes in his uh, stand-up spinning and twirling and I'm putting my foot in his ass. If I have any openings, it's, it's a wrap. I always want to go for the finish, period. I don't care how, how good the showing is, I want the finish. To knock Ed Radcliffe out would be good. Put me back in line where I need to go, back on track. But the main thing is coming out and pulling those triggers right from the beginning, starting this fight 100%, come out guns blazing. He's going to stand in front of me, and I got some tricks up my sleeve for sure. I'm excited for this fight to stand because I've been taken down my last two fights, man, and it's like from finally excited to fight someone's going to stand up and fight me. I'm going to bring myself to Cerrone. I'll kick, punch outside, take him down, stand up with him. It, it doesn't matter. I'm taking the fight to Cerrone. He has a stand-up background. I have a stand-up background, and I'm down to come meet in the middle and throw down.